Hello world, I'm Rich, and this is Rich's World Beer Tour. We're over at Pete's house, enjoying a little family birthday get-together. I just had the uh, state tournament softball. I'm and being... I went and watched and haven't showered since, so that's, pardon my... Uh... That's what it is. Yeah. Stench. I'm, I'm beat. <laughs> I need a good beer. Um, hey, tonight we're, doing, we're going Victory Brewing, the Golden Monkey. I've seen a lot of people buying this. I've never had it. It's a triple, Belgian triple. They I got think a nice. You had one of those today, didn't you? A triple. I did have a triple. Yeah, and I was safe. I so. The old man comes through occasionally. Uh, boy, they got yeah. a lot of rules on the back. Have the ale chilled to 45. Have clean, wide mouth glasses ready. Point the cork away from anyone when opening. Yeah, I don't want Tilt you bottle. Me. Sorry. You don't want to get this bottle condition, so you don't want to uh, get it. I don't have any date on here. It says bottled on. Blank. And, and there's nothing there. Uh, 9.5% ABV. Speaking of ABV, Pete's been uh, doing a little brewing on the side here. We've been talking about things. He made, what was it, Imperial? It was an Imperial Red. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'm hoping that uh, we can do an all grain of that Imperial Red. It was awesome. An absolute caramel bomb uh, with some hoppy, citrusy. Uh, it was good. It was good. So it was ten and a half percent ABV. So it's not bad. We'll see how it is and see if we not can recreate bad. with all grain. Um, That's a nice clear golden color, isn't it? It is. I'm not going to tip it to get all that nasty sediment. So I said to get some. Get some head. I'm going to add a little bit. Hopefully, I don't bring in the wow, the dregs at the bottom. Look at that. That is just a nice. Oh, there's a couple little pieces I got in there. Oh well. It just a. Uh, it reminds me of a like Gold a milk. lemony, light orange. Look at that nice uh, white head. About a finger's worth. Fingers worth. Well, okay. You just got a little more vigorous. I guess if your two fingers are grown together, it'd be a finger's worth. <laughs> On mine, this is uh, malty. You can taste. You can smell that Belgian yeast. That funky barnyard. Barnyardy yep, yeast. I've said that too many times. Yep. Uh, that's what I'm getting is that yeast is ever present, but there's a maltiness behind it. it smells good though. Let's give it a taste. Cheers. Well, that is smooth. That is smooth. Wow. That, that malt is there. There's a citrusy little piece in there. Do you get that at the end? If you just pause a second, um, there's a, what's that taste that's mixing with the citrus at the end? There's something I don't know, I that's, got caramel right on the front. I was going to say, maybe right it's a caramel. Front. Maybe it's a caramel. This thing will uh, bottle condition, so it's going to change over time. This is one you can, you can set in your fridge and, you know, Get two bottles and, and make some notes. Try it now and then try it in six months. Try it in a year. See what uh, goes on with that bottle conditioning. You see that the head is really dissipating. This is a really nice, interesting beer. There's a lot going on. It keeps bubbling, but the head goes away. There is caramel. There's a sweetness. There's a, I don't want to say brown sugar. It's not brown. It's uh, like a, a slight maple syrup piece. That mapley. Um, it's almost like yeah. bubble gum too. There, there is a, Do you get that? <laughs> that 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 taste at the end. It's like a a bubble gum. The way it finishes off. Yeah, it's bubble gum for me. It's the big pink thing you put in your the double bubble bubble double gum. bubble bubble gum. You chowing on that as a kid. This is bubble gum for me at the end. But there's a little bit of citrus too. And I think that's the yeast probably playing in. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're gonna sit and sit and enjoy this one. This is not one that you you drop down in a heartbeat. Yeah, it's just the, the junk left. Golden Monkey. It's a triple from Victory Brewing, out in Pennsylvania. I can't see the screen, so I hope you guys are seeing that. Um, Nine point five percent. This is an absolute nine point five. 
for a beer. I really like this. Yeah, and I was going to say about a nine. But still, a, it, this is an A beer. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and I know there's some people that come into our store all the time and grab it and just love it. And this, this does remind me of the Belgian style that uh, Blacklist, our friends up in Duluth, are putting out that uh, Orta Belgique. Ooh, that's nice. But Victory, this is an absolute winner. Uh, hey, gang, if you've tried this, put some notes down below. See if we're on. If anybody, try it and tell me if you get that bubble gum, if you're getting that citrus, um, that, that, that caramely piece. This is really nice. Thanks Very for good. sharing another beer with us, world. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.